The man found guilty of killing El Paso County Sheriff's Deputy Peter Herrera is now headed to death row. ABC 7 Sam Harrisimowitz was there as Judge Diane Navarrete officially sentenced Facundo Chavez to death. He filed this report. The trial and sentencing of Facundo Chavez came to a close this morning, but the family of El Paso County Sheriff's Deputy Peter Herrera had one last chance to speak to Chavez face to face. The four impact statements delivered this morning were from Deputy Herrera's brother, wife, sister, and mother. Deputy Herrera's wife, Ashley, spoke for the longest out of the four, each filled with grief as they faced the man who killed Deputy Peter Herrera. El Paso District Attorney Bill Hicks was inside the courtroom for today's impact statements and afterwards spoke about the consequences to anyone found guilty of harming law enforcement. And if someone is willing to so brutally murder one of our law enforcement officers, as the sheriff mentioned, who's there to protect the regular citizen? We take these, very, these crimes extremely seriously and we will take make sure we will make sure that the ultimate form of justice comes for these people. The family not only giving those impact statements inside the courthouse, they did deliver a statement to the media following today's final day in court. I'll bring that coming up on ABC 7 at 6. For now, reporting inside the county courthouse, I'm Sam Harrisimowitz, ABC 7.